Go ahead. As you can see in the video, the uh, trim tabs are moving up. That's the adjustments for the motors. That's forward. That's reverse. Do the rudder. That's with the stick steer. All the control unit. As you can see, the batteries are mounted. There's the charger right there, 36 volt charger. That's the hydraulic unit for the uh, trim tabs. Back seat. That's the stick steer right there that operates the uh, rudder and speed control. Uh, and those are the switches that are going to have to be mounted. That's the 12 volt battery that's up front that runs all the uh, trim tabs and that because they're 12 volt instead of 36 volt. Bolt needs a good cleaning, but the hull's in perfect condition. The original. Uh, water line was supposed to be right here and she's sitting in the water about this deep so the batteries have got to be moved up front um, I've got the engine cover for it and there's a rear seat for it and you can see underneath the hulls perfect like I said just needs a good clean and trailer is excellent got a spare for it right there takes a uh, one and seven eighths inch ball that can be changed to a two inch if you had to like I said you can see the holes perfect on it uh, that's about it that's as far as we've progressed uh, we took her out and with all the weight in the back end uh, she still ran good but she didn't steer real well the rudders got to be changed the rudders uh, in the back end is too small it needs to be about twice the size as it is and probably lowered down about two to three inches everything else uh, operated perfectly that's it